my goodness, Irene, this is amazing. We're so overwhelmed. DMG Mori City, a great concept. Who came up with this? And I think it's here to stay. Yes, yeah, so thank you very much. So first of all, very welcome to you and the team. We are super delighted to have you here. Well, it's uh, Friday and uh, we are having our city now open since one week. And you're asking me, yeah, why is Team Shimori City? Well, we were really thinking about the concept about emo show and we know the world of exhibition is changing. So um, we were thinking about something new and uh, really a story which we have to tell about our products and also to guide the visitor through this completely hall too, which we have is about 9,000 square meters. So together with my team, we were just, yeah, we were at the point sitting together and discussing. And, you know, in the past, sometimes people told us, yeah, if I come to you, even if it's front end open house or uh, in hall two, it's like a, it's like a city. And so then we were thinking about what are cities, right? And uh, cities stand for urban life, for tech, uh, processes, for technology, for architecture, for Unix skylines. And so we thought, yes, and cities are also a place for encounter and for cultural exchange. And that's all, uh, yeah, that's all what we have here on such a, let's say, Hall 2 booth, Team Shimori City. And this is how the idea was born, uh, yeah, I think more than a year ago, yes. It's incredible. I mean, you've got 39 machines, 21 different forms of automation solutions. I've got to ask you, though, which one's your favorite and why? Well. One of my favorites is the <laughs> IN863 okay. um, because it's a world premiere uh, and this uh, machine is made in Japan and this is a, let's say, also a symbol for machining transformation, which is one of our topics here because machining transformation uh, yeah, has a lot of pillars. So one is, for example, process integration. Um, one is automation, one is green transformation, one is sustainability. And uh, with this machine, we can show everything. So process integration means it's a five axis machine, but you also have different uh, other processes like grinding inside. So this means a customer might not need two machines to follow mm -hmm. one process. Yeah. It has two different technologies in one machine. And in addition, it also is connected to automation. So you can connect different automation solutions. And all this helps for sustainability because with no two machines, you have just one machine and you have just the process integrated. So this means you have, uh, yeah, you need less space, you need less power, you need less transportation, cost for whatever. Um, and also the automation solutions, right? So this, uh, yeah, saves, saves different tasks. Uh, and uh, this is, yeah, for me, the symbol of machining transformation. So please have a look at it later. <laughs> oh, it, re it really is. It's fascinating, it is. And it's kind of bringing the whole industry for the engineer together. You're making their lives easier. You're thinking about them at yes. the forefront of your um, evolution here at DMG Mori. Um, let's choose one of them. And that was the green transformation. Yes. Different people have a different perspective on green transformation across the globe. So what, what are you getting as a global perspective, more people are more conscious of it. Absolutely, and I think also um, people will take into consideration sustainability and also the green transformation when it comes to purchasing decisions in the future, right? Mm. And uh, it's super important that our engineers are developing and uh, researching in the field of sustainability and how to make our machines more sustainable yes. and how to make processes more sustainable and how to save money in the, yeah, in the process of machining. And um, yeah, so this is one of the pillars which says machining transformation. And um, as you said, transformation and the city and we also said at the beginning the city concept um, you know when cities are built um, it also needs development and the city is built step by step and development means also transformation and that's why we also thought coming to the first question that this team Shimori city and the process of transformation very well uh, fits to this concept and as you can see here the butterfly it's, which uh, it's yeah, stunning which is the yeah, storyteller of our Diem Shimori city concept. And um, a butterfly is a symbol of transformation. And that's why we choose this butterfly to be the storyteller of all these 
great things we have is machining transformation, green, sustainable transformation. And the butterfly you can see here, which we animated, is a real part. And uh, it's incredible. This incredible. part was made by a Japanese customer on a DMU50 machine, so on a DM Shimori machine. And uh, yeah, we are super proud to have the part here. And also that we uh, brought the butterfly to life, showing us the world of transformation. It's a beautiful message. Yeah, I also think so. Irene, there's so much to see here. What are the topics and trends that you're hearing people talk about at the show? Yeah, so um, mainly the topics we are hearing um, fits also to our, let's say, strategy of machine transformation. So we really hear a lot of, of course, automation. And this means it's, it's not dedicated to customers or visitors from some regions. It's really an overarching topic is automation is coming more and more into the, the focus. Future. It's the future, right? And um, the other topic, of course, digitization. We always say digitization is a tool um, to make process integration possible, to facilitate um, uh, automation and many, many other things. And, of course, sustainability. So we hear much more people and uh, customers and visitors talking about sustainable production, how they can make their production more sustainable, right? Mm. So this means it's not uh, only a value, which will be more important for also for the younger generation, of right? Course. Sustainable production, sustainability. So this is super important for the younger generation, um, but also how to save money. Right? Yeah. How to save money and how to produce in a more sustainable way. So I think this will be also future trends, which uh, yeah, which are super interesting and which we are working, uh, developing, and researching. AI, it's a topic that it's a. I'm hearing it quite a bit. Yeah. Are people embracing it? Are they moving it? For, are, are they taking it seriously? Where where are we with AI right now? Yeah. I think, I mean, in the last months, we got a really push in AI and, uh, and uh, yeah, AI developments, of course. And uh, I hear, or we hear, a lot of people talking about it. Um, some people are still skeptical, but on the other hand, I think it's a development and uh, that's a trend which is unstoppable. And um, it could be and it will be, um, a, it will have a huge impact in the future for us. I'm very much convinced about that. And also if we think about digital twin, right? Or digital engineering, this is what we are already working on it, right? So uh, this is, will be super important in the future. And um, think about um, digital trainings, for example, uh, with AI tools and digital twin training. So th those are super things which are coming in the future and which are already here, right? Here. So we are working already mm. with this and we can uh, showcase this already ready here at the show or in our factories and I, I think these are the trends for the future automation as you said AI digital twin and of course the sustainability it's safe to say there's a lot of excitement coming from Absolutely, DMG yes, and, and I'm so much looking forward to it yeah. yes <laughs> <Me too. laughs>